The Department of Homeland Security has revealed that over 1 million illegal immigrants have been admitted into the country since Biden first took office. These illegal immigrants uh, may stay into the country up to seven years while awaiting their hearing. Meanwhile, the Federation for American Immigration Reform says that close to 4.9 million people may have crossed the border since Biden first became president. The Federation says in addition, 2,000 pounds of fentanyl and 12,000 pounds of meth were seized at the border in July alone. Meanwhile, Texas Senator Ted Cruz recently attacked the Biden administration for downplaying the crisis at the border. We saw Corrine Jean-Pierre stand up and say, People are not crossing the border. They're not walking across the border. Listen, we're used to flax spinning. This was a flat out lie. It's an objective lie. It is 100% false. I invited her come down to the border and see it. And her response was, I don't need to be lectured by Republican senators. Now, as far as voters are concerned, polling shows that the majority of Americans either want immigration levels decreased or to remain about the same. Visit FISM.TV news for more content.